So now we're going to make two microbits communicate with each other. And we're going to do this with the built-in radio function that they have. Uh, so the example we're going to build is uh, when I press on the button on this microbit, we're going to send a message to the other microbit, which will show it on the screen, and also the other way around. So let's start by going into our editor. And this, in this case, I'm using the PXT editor. And in the menu, we see there's a category called radio. And if we go in there, there is a block called radio send number. But we want to send a text instead. So we go for the other block that's called radio send string. We drag that in. And then we write what text we want to send. Let's see, let's write hello. And we want this to happen when we press on the A button. So this we find in the input category. And there we have it. On button A pressed, then we want to send the string, the text. So now we have our first part of the code done. The second part is for uh, what will happen when we receive this text. And for this we go into the radio category again. Here we see there's a block for when we receive a number, but we take the block on radio received, received string, when we receive a text. So, and what should happen when we receive a string, when we receive a text? Well, we want to show it on the screen. And for this we go into the basic category, and there we find show string. There we go. Now, which string do we want to show? Well, it's called received string. And this one we find in the variables category. There we go. Drag it in, connect it together. So now it says, when the radio receives a string, show this string that is called received string. So now we're done with our coding. So let's grab our USB cable and a microbit. And we download the program and save it on the microbit. And this microbit I'm going to power with a battery pack so I can have it uh, on a distance away from the other microbit to see that it's actually wireless communication. There we go. And now we download the same program to the other microbit as well. So we press download and save. And let's see when that is done. There. So now what should happen is that when I press the A button over here, we should see hello on the other micro bit. Let's see. There we go. It says hello. And the same thing if I press on the button over here, we get it on the display on the other micro bit as well. So that's a very quick example on how you can use radio communication between two micro bits to send over a piece of text. Uh, but this is just very quick and, and easy. Uh, you can also send over uh, numbers instead. And the way you use this can be uh, totally up to you. So, for example, you could make an alarm system where uh, one microbit recognizes that somebody breaks in and then it sends a message to another microbit that is on a, on a distance. Uh, or you could have some uh, program that, based on what kind of uh, text it receives, it does a specific action. So there you would use, for example, an if statement. Or you could make some kind of program where you have one a uh, microbit that sends over uh, the sensor data to the other microbit which can display it. So for example, like the brightness or whatever it is that you want to measure. So it's totally up to you to come up with ways to use this radio communication. So go ahead. <laughs>